Hi everyone, I'm back to share my CVS haul with you. Um, I did this earlier in the week, but I'm just now getting a chance to make a video. So as always, welcome my new subscribers and viewers to this channel. If you haven't done so already, please check out the video I posted earlier of my Meyer and Rite Aid haul. So let's get started. This is several transactions, starting with the All May Liquid Lip Balm. Okay, this week you spend 10, you get a $4 ECB. These are $5.99 each, and so for two of them, that came to $11.98. I used a 4 off 12 cosmetic CVS coupon. These were printing just about every day last week. Also on coupons.com, there are $1 printables, so that brought my total to $5.98. I used a $4 ECB from last week, so I paid $2 and change out of pocket and got back a $4 ECB. So that's a small money maker for me. Second transaction, I got two of the Burt's Bees lip glosses. This week when you spend $15, you get a $5 ECB. These are $8.99 each. For two of them, that's $17.98. I had another 4 off 12 cosmetic CVS coupon. Also on coupons.com, there are $2 coupons um, for Burt's Bees lip gloss. So um, that brought my total to $9.98. Also, I used the $4 ECB from the All May Lip Balm. So, um, remaining was about $6 and change. I put that on a CVS gift card. So, zero out of pocket and got back a $5 ECB. Okay, this is all one transaction here. And sorry if I'm talking fast, guys. My six-month-old is in the background and he's kind of cranky. So, I'm trying to get through this. Okay, so these head and shoulders were on clearance at my store. They're $3.99 each. I used a BOGO coupon. And these are the bigger bottles. These are 23.7 fluid ounces. Next, the men's speed stick here. A $3 off 2 CVS red box coupon printed for me. It did not specify a size, so I got these out the travel section. These were $1.27 each, so I had a little less than $0.50 cents in overage. The Sally Henson this week, you spend 12 you get a $5 ECB. So I picked up a Hard as Nails Extreme Wear Nail Color and a Salon FX Real Nail Polish Strips. Um, I used a $2 CVS coupon that gave you $2 off Sally Henson. Also, I had a $2 um, coupon for the nail strips. These came out of the 728 Red Plum. I did not have a coupon for the nail color. Um, the way this worked out for me was, um, oh, also the 25% that um, I got through email applied to these because these were not on sale. So after the coupons and the 25% came to about $6.89 and I got back a $5 ECB. Then the Nexus. This week you spend $20, you get a $10 ECB. The 25% of also applied to these because they were not on sale. So I picked up a Frizz Defy Frizz uh, Protection Shampoo. And then uh, the smaller bottle is Ultimate Moisture Conditioner. Uh, the shampoo was $10.99 and the conditioner was $10.49. So there was a $2 off to shampoo or conditioner red box coupon that printed. I used that, the 25%. So after that, this came to about $15 and I got back a $10 ECB. So those are about $2.50 each. And then these razors. This is part of the Gillette deal. You spend 30, you get 10. These were the cheapest razors in my store. These were $8.99. So they had, I would need to buy four of these to meet $30 to get the $10 ECB back. This particular store, they had four razors available, but with the BOGO coupons, we all know your mileage may vary. It, it's based on store, cashier. So I did two of them to see how it would work, and it did auto-deduct. I was going to go back to get two more packages, but the line just got too long. So I finished up that deal at a different CVS. So for all of this, I started with 15 ECBs from last week, and I paid $9.34 out of pocket, including tax, and I got back 15 ECBs. Okay, so the next CVS I went to, I finished up the razor deal. These were $8.79 at that store, and they did not auto-deduct the coupon, which was kind of a bummer. Um, but anyway, I finished that so I can get my $10 ECB. And then the toilet paper, paper towels, puffs, 
This week you spend $20, you get back a $5 ECB. Now, I believe there are coupons available for some of these. However, I did not use any. Um, so, I used the 15 ECBs from that transaction. Now, when I buy paper products, I always spend more out of pocket if I have ECBs or not. So, I used 15 ECBs from those products. I also had to pay $15.99 out of pocket. But I did get back $15 in ECBs for next week. So I made out pretty well. This is all that I got. Um, I'm pretty much done with CVS this week. And I will be planning my next shopping trip shortly, which will be for this upcoming Sunday. So as always, if you have any questions or comments, please leave those below. If you found this video helpful, um, please subscribe and support my channel. I really appreciate it. And I will talk to you guys in the next video.